those who were infected in the second wave, which was now dominated by what we have been referring to as the new variant, 501YV2, have protection from current and previous circulating variants. The 501YV2 variant is able to generate immune responses we have now found out through our scientists that neutralize itself and other SARS COVID-2 lineages. It seems like uh, if you actually are infected with this variant, and this, of course, these are, this is limited, this statement is limited to these results with neutralization antibodies. But if you're infected with this variant or you can design a vaccine with this variant, it might be cross protective to other variants. It might leave the virus with not much room to go. One thing that we show now the new results is that the plasma, the plasma collected from people infected with the variant has good neutralizing activity against itself, but also against the first wave virus and potentially other variants of concerns, yeah? What it means, it means that people infected may have some immunity against the variant and other lineages, but it also means that we know that immunity can decrease over time. So in no way we are saying that these people shouldn't be vaccinated, the opposite. Everyone we should try to increase vaccination to avoid that very deadly third wave, yeah?